I posted this recipe on Instagram a week or so ago, and so I wanted to make sure I shared it with everyone. I pretty much cook a bunch of pasta, and I've been spiralizing a bunch of zucchini and carrots at the beginning of the week, and then each night I kind of throw this together. So this is a single serving recipe, but I will make sure that I include the measurements for multiple servings on my website. To make your sauce, you need two tablespoons of warm water, two tablespoons of peanut butter, a half tablespoon of soy sauce, a half tablespoon of agave nectar or maple syrup, a half tablespoon of rice wine vinegar, a teaspoon of oil, and if you like a little heat, like I do, one teaspoon of shiracha sauce. I, I pronounce that wrong all the time. <laughs> Mix it together, it doesn't have to be perfectly smooth. It's gonna smooth out once you put it in the pot. We're going to use one cup of julienne or spiralized zucchini and a half cup of julienne or shredded carrots. I purchased this $20 handheld gadget from Walmart in the As Seen on TV section. <laughs> I wanted to see if I liked it. Um, it works pretty well with vegetables shaped like zucchini but not really anything else any bigger. I also have a julienne peeler that works really well too. And I bought this for the same price, $20, from Amazon several years ago. And I'll have links to these products in the description box. So to put this all together, you're gonna heat a small pot over medium heat, add one cup of pasta and your sauce. You're gonna stir it for a few minutes. You just want the pasta to be heated through, especially if you're using leftovers like I am. Once it's heated through, add the zucchini and the carrots and you're gonna just keep stirring it for about 20 seconds. And the goal is to slightly warm the vegetables but not cook them and make sure everything is coated in the sauce. That's it. You could make this without the pasta if you'd like. You could add some other veggies and really make it your own. You could also make a larger batch like I mentioned before. Has anyone been eating spiralized zucchini? I'm trying to incorporate more veggies and raw food in my diet. How are you preparing it? Are you eating it raw in a salad or are you cooking it just a little bit? I think I like it better raw. So let me know what you guys are doing if you're, anybody's doing any spiralizing out there. Thank you for watching Vegan Cooking with Love. Do you want to be the first to know about my upcoming products? Click on my logo and sign up. You'll also get weekly vegan cooking tips and over 30 ideas for vegan meatless Mondays. It includes easy and super easy meals for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and over 30 vegan food substitutes. Taking that first step has never been easy.